This is a rapid fire crossbow that shoots darts. <laughs> and this is a mega crossbow that shoots mega darts. And today I invited the basketball content king of YouTube to face off against me in a mini crossbow target shootout. Let's go. But what he doesn't know is that my crossbow is anything but mini. Let's do this. Mark! Mark, I'm outside! Oh, come on in! Welcome to Crunch Labs. Thank you, this place is amazing. Bit of a competition today, we're building this beauty. That's sick! You can see the accuracy. This is Jester level accuracy. <laughs> you get a box. Okay. I get a box. 20 minutes on the clock. What do we do? Build it. We have to build it? All right, I got this. All right, first Crunch Labs build. Okay, I'm very nervous because Mark literally made these, but I'm gonna try my best. Step one is just like a sticker. Put the foam on it. Easy. Yeah! The build's starting to feel good. I really want to beat Mark. Final step. Boom! Okay, now, test fire, make sure it works. Let's go! It's perfect! Mark, I actually finished it! In time! Mark, I won! What? <laughs> How did you build that? Well, Jester, we built the Mega Crossbow with industrial strength bungees that can exert 1,700 pounds of force, which I suppose by comparison, <laughs> maybe a bit of overkill. I believe in your world, they call this home court advantage. This is insane. <laughs> so I figure we just have a little friendly competition, right? Wait, I have to use that and you can do yeah, this? Yeah, I mean, look, you use what you built, Jester. You, you didn't build this in 20 minutes. <laughs> Actually, I did. Oh, these are heavy. <laughs> All right, we'll start with the classic six red cup shooter. See how many you can knock off the pedestal. I'm gonna stare you down, Mark. <laughs> Wait, I swear that is. Yeah, I would recommend looking. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Boom! Yes! Hey, wow! Two hey. left. Boom! Oh, okay, last shot. Please. All right. Oh! I'll take that. That was that. kinda sick. I'll take that. That was a cool snipe. All right. Hey, remember, you only get one shot. Jesser, I only need one shot. Okay. Load him up. No way. That's the sound of power. Hey, I was more efficient though. I already been shot twice. It's going so <laughs> slow. Firing in three, two, one. You went through the wall. God. Wait, I win! I did sort of miss the cops. <laughs> oh this is insane. God. We're getting so many holes in this wall. <laughs> wow! Oh my goodness. Well, I mean, technically you won that challenge. Let's go! We have way more targets to shoot out. However, I think these poor Crunch Labs walls need some reinforcements. That should do. Nice. Oh, oh no way. Oh. What? Oh. Hey, I'll count it. As we fired more and more targets, it quickly became clear that the regular crossbow had better accuracy. I got this. Oh. Yeah. However, it was no match for the mega crossbow in terms of raw destructive power. And by the way, while this one's way too big to get shipped to your house, you can get the super cool one Jester's using by simply visiting crunchlabs.com with the parents to learn more. So we decided to mix up the competition to see who could correctly predict the crossbow's destructive capabilities against increasingly extreme objects. And to decide who gets the first crossbow launch, we faced off in a best of three basketball shootout. Going for three for three. Yes! Oh, it even returned it to you. <laughs> I'll go back. What have I done? No! Oh, okay, I needed that. I gotta get at least two. Oh. All right, you can take this. Deep breath. Yes! Okay, let's one for go. one. Yes! Mark, bro, foot was on the line. What? No, it counts, it counts, it counts. Someone FaceTime Mr. Beast, I need redemption. For the win! And after the greatest upset in YouTube history, we moved on to the first of our destruction prediction challenges. Eight layers of one and a half inch thick ice. Okay, I think it might get through like two. Why? I just feel like this is probably the same thickness of the wall, right? And this is kind of blunt, which is why we're not gonna use this, Chester. We're not using that? We're using this. Oh, it's like a <laughs> rocket ship. This is the silver bullet, <laughs> baby. Wait, that's insane. I think it'll do four. It's so powerful. You said 1,700 pounds of fours? I think it'll do five. <laughs> all right, I think it's gonna do all eight. All eight and hit the concrete. And hit the concrete. Only one way to find out. 
this is like a tank. <laughs> Go through all the walls. Go through just five. <laughs> Ready to launch the silver bullet in three, two, one. Oh my goodness! Well, one, two, three, four. And wood, it broke the wood. And wood. <laughs> I think it skimmed up. I think we need to give another go and try to hit it dead yeah, center. Yeah, 100%. We need to run that back. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh! Let's go! No way! Wow! Time no for an official way. count. <laughs> one, two, three, Four. I said four. You made me change it to five. <laughs> you Dang were closer. It. How strong is this ice? <laughs> Boom. Are you okay? <laughs> ice is heavy. <laughs> there, you want to try? It's kind of satisfying. <laughs> that is so fun. And the sound is like so satisfying. <laughs> Next! All right, Jesse, what do you predict? I honestly think it's gonna go through one of the bottom boxes, out the other end, hit the concrete. I just predict we're gonna see a lot of packing peanuts flying through the air. <laughs> okay. Three, two, one. Oh! Whoa! Those boxes are powerful! That's solid oak. Mark, I literally only see one packing peanut. Yeah, that was disappointing. <laughs> Look at the silver bullet! Wow. Damn, I really thought it would go through. I think because it's sort of weak, it like absorbed a lot of the energy. Well, the crates win this round. Yeah. But I kind of wanted to see a lot of packing peanuts. We can still make that happen. Three, two, one. Oh, dang it. These crates are just amazing. <laughs> Cannonball. <laughs> I'm coming in! <laughs> this is comfy. This is very comfy. I like this. Nice. <sighs> they need to drop a packing peanut mattress. I'm copping. Yeah, I'm there. That's our new merch idea. I like it. With our first billion dollar idea in the bank, we loaded up some giant balloons to see if it would just flex or pop in a spectacular fashion. Okay, I've been wrong in every prediction. You would think it would easily go through all three, but I'm saying two because I think it's gonna go like this. Oh ye of little faith. I think it's going dead nuts right through. Let's see. Okay. Three, two, one. Yeah. I swear it went like sideways. I kind of felt like it did too. I'm not sure how, but yes. Regardless, the balloons are popped. And with another W in the bag for Team Rober, we moved on to putting our future luck on the line with eight tantalizingly breakable mirrors. First of all, can I just point out a pair of handsome devils right there? Especially you, Mark. Oh, come on now. <laughs> My prediction for this one, I'm going all eight. It's destroying it. I love the optimism. I'm sticking with four. Okay. Wait, why not all eight? You sure you don't want to go five? No, no, no. <laughs> No, not again. <laughs> All right, eight mirrors, seven years of bad luck. That's 56 years of bad luck. Oh. In fact, here, why don't you push this? <laughs> okay, we push it together. Same time. Okay. Not that superstitions are real, but you know. Just in case they are. Yeah. Three, two, one. <laughs> Only I press this. Oh, really? <laughs> Whoops. Okay, you do believe. Okay. Whoa. Well. It didn't go through all of them, we can say that much. Wait, was it four? Please be four. One, two, three, four, let's go! You know what's gonna look really sick? The slow-mo shot. Roll it. Ooh. That's awesome. Going into our last round undefeated, it seemed Jesser had finally found a winning strategy. My prediction for this one, I'm stealing your number four. I'm going with four. You know what that means? What? I'm going with eight. You think it could break eight? Bro, this feels I don't know. solid, I don't know, you're kind of right. <laughs> All right, Lego wall, let's go eight. Bring it back. In three, two, one, five. Whoa! It might be four. It might be, it four. Might be. Okay. No way. Okay. Oh, look. A Lego made it all the way over here. That's why we have the protection. That's right. That thing <laughs> saved our lives. Well, it doesn't look like eight. <laughs> Wait, three maybe? Oh, three. I've kind of always wanted to do this. Yeet. 
That was epic. That looks so fun. Boom! Oh, uh, wasn't as cool as That was kind of weak. <laughs> well, since technically neither of us was right, I have an idea for a tiebreaker. What is it? Hold, please. Okay. I'm holding. What is that? First one to throw the bowling ball all the way through wins the round. Do you want to throw first? I'm going through all the walls. <laughs> yes! I did not think that would go. <laughs> that was wow. Okay, technically you did win that, but I want my own go. Okay, Jesser, you've been such a delightful guest here today at Crunch Labs. We have one final challenge, and I think I'm actually just gonna bring this in. I'm excited. Stay here. Stay here? Okay. Are you serious? Oh, yeah. I didn't know you were that strong either. Oh, yeah. It's all me, that's for sure. <laughs> this is so oh, ridiculous. Yeah. We're no expense, pal. Brand new jack. Brand new. Well, this thing is rusty. All right, what's your prediction for this one? Oh. Best case scenario, explosion. Yes. I predict it's going through all four windows. <laughs> it's gonna go through two, it's gonna hit the cement block, it's gonna bounce back and go through the other two. I'm thinking it's just a little dent, actually. Only time will tell. Final shot. Let's go! Three, two, one. <laughs> that was actually kind of cool. Yeah, we got one window and a dent. <laughs> we both won. You think this door still works? Oh yeah. Wow, good as new. <laughs> it doesn't close? You just gotta kind of lean like this. So, Jesser, you kind of won every competition. Yeah, you were spot on with the prediction. I'm gonna say you win the car. I win this car. Yeah. <laughs> the Jag oh. is yours. I'm basically Mr. Beast, just giving out cars. No one's ever done something like this yeah. for me before. She's all yours. Um, she doesn't run, but you'll figure it out. Thank you. Dude, oh look, this fell off too. You're welcome, Jesser.